hi guys uh welcome back to guru tech networking training so in, th in this video we're going to learn how to download and install windows 10 client virtual machine on a vmware workstation pro 17 okay so in the previous video we learned how to download and install windows server 2012 r2 virtual machine so remember these are sysadmin uh operation so we need to download both the server and the client so that we can do uh, and test various simulations, okay? All right. So uh, uh, to, uh, to download our Windows 10 uh, client machine, just you can just go and search uh, Windows 10, uh, Windows 10 download, okay? Then you see where you can download it. You can download it from the official web, uh, Microsoft or any other uh, actually site, okay? right so in this case i've already downloaded mine so here is my windows 10 client machine okay right so what i'm gonna do you just go to home right or you just go to file on the vmware workstation and you click new virtual machine or you just do it directly from here okay so let me just do it from here create new virtual machine then we name it as a uh, we name it as a uh, sorry Yes, uh, next, then we choose the location of our virtual machine, our ISO. Here it is, Windows 10 updated. Okay, then click next. Then we name it now, Windows 10 Client VM. The previous one was actually Windows Server VM, okay? Then click next. Then here you can maybe allocate it uh, like let's just say 40 GB okay all right 40 GB 60, 60 is too much uh, because we don't we're not going to install a lot of things on this uh, uh, client machine so 40 is okay click next and uh, let's just customize that way we see if we can amend anything uh, the mem, mem is okay 2 GB is okay for it processors it okay is okay the location of the file ISO file is okay. The direct adapter in this lab, we are going to rely on NAT. Okay, All right. So we just click finish and give it some time to create disk so that we can continue the installation. Yeah. Okay, so uh, it has attached the disk. So here the installation will actually commence. So press any key. I have pressed any key then let's just give it a few minutes okay so here okay so here actually we're just going to do a um, uh, boot normally okay just eat boot normally and uh, give it a few minutes so you see our Windows 10 actually it's uh, installing the installation will actually begin Okay, so our uh, language with that one, everything remains that one. Just click OK. Install, just the normal way you normally do, and actually uh, installing Windows 10. Okay, so as per now, I don't have the product key, I don't have a product key. Proceed with that option. Then here we're going to choose Windows 10 Pro uh, X64. Okay. Let's continue. Right, so accept the license terms and go to a custom installation and just click next. Yeah, so you see it's just installing. I'll be back when it's done. okay so the installation is done so it will just need to restart uh, the uh, the operating system okay so here we are all right so let's just uh, set it up uh, just choose it randomly okay so a keyboard okay 
keep and um, network okay Okay, so here we have, so let us choose for personal uh, use, then uh, next, and then we're going to set up our uh, account actually, yeah. So here, offline account, and then um, limited, uh, just proceed with limited experience, and then GTEC, right, then okay, uh, proceed with that password, and uh, actually, now it's like we're done with this setup. Okay, so accept. Accept. Skip. Um, okay, no problem. Right, so I think uh, everything is such a setup, and uh, we have the Windows 10 client on this side, and on this other side we have Windows 10 server, uh, Windows uh, Windows Server 2012 R2. Okay. Okay, so we are already set up. You can see our Windows 10 uh, client is here. So we can even check IP address by CMD. CMD, then you type IP config. Okay, you can see it's in the range of the IP address that the, uh, the server took, right? Okay, all right, guys, thank you so much. And let's see you again 